What's going on, guys? This is Riggs from Clashing FFS. And if you guys didn't know by now, for those of you that are new to the channel, just only across the channel, I always like to feature unique style attacks, non-meta attacks, attacks you do not see every day on the channel. For any CWO clans out there, if you're watching this, by chance, if you are watching this, CWO going on this weekend, if there's a non-meta or just a unique attack, uh, feel free to hit me up either via the comment section. You can always find me on Discord and DM me there. Uh, to, if you know if you have a, a unique attack you want to see featured on the channel, feel free to hit me up. I have no problem coming to your clan and recording the attack. But in this one right here, you guys, I did not have to go very far. Uh, as as most of you know, I do have my mini here in FYSB. And this is week six in CWO Premiere. We have Espanka Nobs BR. I believe uh, this is a Brazilian clan, but this is gonna be uh, from Premiere. The attack I'm gonna show you guys is the hit right here on number 12. I'm gonna go ahead and pause it real quick. And like you probably saw in the thumbnail already, who needs heal spells for hogs? Who needs them? This is probably, and I already know every time I say, this is the first time I've ever seen this attack. I got 69 different people in the comments section saying, oh, I've been doing this for, you know, since 2015. Check out the troop comp, you guys. We got six, uh, no, no, we got five skeleton spells, four of his own, one maxed in the CC. We got a poison, and we have three rages. Yet, look at the army comp. We got, we got four healers. We got 32 hogs. When I first saw this, when I just saw the troop comp, I was thinking, okay, it's gonna be like a you know a queen charge uh, mass hog attack, you know, just a standard queen hoe. But wait till you guys see this. The first thing you need to check out is look at this core. No splash really reaches this core. The bomb tower is kind of due on the edges, but with that queen smack dab in the center, wait until you guys see this. We got four healers, three rages, a whole bunch of hogs and some skeleton spells as and without further ado we'll go ahead and hit play but check this out the first thing little britches i want to give a big shout out to little britches coming up from fysb unbuckled fysb's um sister clan but here we go rage spell down there goes the five skeleton spells look at what they're gonna get they're getting queen they're getting cc they're picking up two expos and one of the most important things is they're helping break that defensive ring by taking out uh, those expos inside the core. It, I mean, it's just a complete circle around this base for all the defenses. Queen down. Now, we still have two rages and a whole bunch of hogs. Riggs, how's that going to work? I thought you need heal spells for hogs. Just just be patient. Just wait, and you will find out. So now what Lil Britches wants to do is take out King. So he's just going to do a, a Town Hall 8 style king swap just with one wizard to help with that funnel. Enemy king is down. Enemy queen is now down. So now what he's going to do is use his queen once he pops ability. Go ahead and take out an air defense and also pick up a cannon. So there you go. And even gets a giant bomb uh, just for good measure. So starting with the CC hogs over here at 9 o'clock. Dropping down those two healers we got two rages for these hogs you guys more hogs coming in on the mortar just to kind of meet up that's traditionally where you would drop a heal spell but no little britches says absolutely not i do not drop heal spells for my hogs in <laughs> every single place where uh he goes ahead or she maybe it's a she uh drops down the ra rage spells that's traditionally where you'd be dropping down a heal spell but look at these healers what is happening here i don't even understand Everything I know is wrong. Uh, up is down, left is right at this point in this game. No splash, all the splash has been, has been taken care of. Just three point defenses left and two air defenses. Not gonna do a whole lot. Uh, and already started cleanup. I just have one more wizard to go ahead and deploy. But it's nothing but cleanup, you guys. Nothing but cleanup. It got a little close on time. Maybe, um, we could br maybe brought a miner uh, just to help with the clean up a little bit, but does not matter. Gets to three star in by far, I know I've said this a bunch, but by far one of the most unique attacks that I, that I have seen. I'm sorry, rewind it if you don't believe me. Without a doubt, one of the most unique attacks, and it's not Mwasom, like we featured a couple times on the channel 
uh, with the healers on the hogs uh, because there was no queen. Ch- there was no queen charge. I don't. I don't even understand. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and check out one more attack. This one. This is just a, kind of like a bonus attack. Again, something we don't see all the time. Actually, it's not that one. Big shout out uh, to Trey Smith though because the dude six packed. I clicked on the wrong one. Okay, this attack right here, you guys. Bringing three golems on this bitch attack. He is wrecking it. Trey Smith wrecking it with bitch um, and with uh, kill squad hogs like we saw in the other one. But here we go. And this is, um, th- I mean, this raid is going to be over in about a minute and a half, you guys. Just completely ends up wrecking this base. Uh, you'll see golems, uh, one golem up at 12, one over here on the far right hand side at 3 o'clock, one going right up the center. Uh, right up the middle with all of the bowlers behind, even a baby drag helping out uh, with that funnel. Uh, King and Queen also behind. And we have a jump spell, a rage, and a heal spell. Second jump spell is down leading into these uh, these back end inferno towers with one more rage to go. And look at Queen, look at these flanks, nice and solid. Uh, I like this one down here, look at that. That is how you know you have a good flank. And up here, uh, that golem still doing a little bit of tanking for those witches. And this base just completely gets leveled, it seemed like, in a matter of seconds. Uh, the key thing is, like on most of these attacks, is saving that Archer Queen ability. Goes ahead and pops it at the last second. Uh, takes out the Wizard Tower, takes out the Arch Tower, and even takes out uh, that cannon. And uh, to start off the raid, I said, pay close attention to this flank right here. Nice and healthy. Going to go ahead and take out the remaining defenses. We'll go ahead and times for this. But you guys were here for that incredible hog attack. Uh, I get apparently you don't need heal spells for hogs anymore from uh, little bridges. Again, coming up from FYSB Unbuckled in the big leagues now here in Premier. But we're looking solid uh, and pretty much dead even too. 49. Uh, attacks used for FYSB, 50 attacks used for Esponka Noves BR, and both with uh, 23 stars so far. But that's going to do it for the video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you did, uh, make sure you go ahead and leave it a like. Comments, questions, or concerns down in the comment section below. Of course, subscribe to the channel if you have not already. As always, this is Riggs from Clashing FFS, and I'll see you in the very next video.